So as you're heading out on this stateful hike, uh, and you're in the car together, what is the state of your relationship at that point? Because there was talk that Rhonda had said to her mother, he's either going to propose to me or push me off a cliff. Yeah, push me or kill me. I think two people from her family have said that. Obviously, that's absurd. I've never heard that. When we got to the top, uh, I remember we kissed for a little bit. Um, I remember she wanted to have sex. Will you tell me what you saw? And tell this audience what you saw. I saw her go off the trail. That's what I'm going to say. Um, As a result of a jump, a slip, or a push? Mm, I had absolutely no physical contact with her. So no um, push? Yeah, and no indirect. In changing your story with this radical new information about a potential suicide, are you lying to me, Stephen? About what in particular? About the suicide me, possibility. I, I, but I already told you I wasn't going to answer that. You're no, the possibility. You've raised this. These, well, this audience is really smart, and they know you have now raised the possibility that this was a suicide. Sure. That she didn't just slip off, but jumped off. You've right. raised that possibility with us. And are you lying on that story? It's one of the two. It's either that due to the situations of the weather, and I think the amount of drugs she was on and her condition, she slipped and fell. Or it was a pre-planned action on her part where she wanted to end her life. It's one of those two.